Hello survivors, Wanderer here. Welcome back to Fallout 4 Frost. So last episode we were successful in getting some antibiotics. We lucked out the very first uh, medical first aid uh, supply chest that we opened up had a antibiotic in it as well as a bunch of other good stuff. But there are at least two or three more of those in this hospital and I want them all. So we're going to loot through the whole thing, get everything we can, then head back up. We can kind of slow down now and take our time exploring this place. That was the main thing. Oh man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna save for uh, anti-crash because I, man, oh man, I don't want to lose that. Like if I come back here and and if there's not one in there, that suck really bad. Um, I think I can just toss this in there. That's nah, not gonna do it. Totally whiffed that one. Gotta wait for it to go away now. If I try to toss a mine down there, it's just gonna, like, it's gonna be bad. It's gonna kill me. Ah! There are a bunch more in there as well. If there's a survivor in here, it'll, he'll probably be up top somewhere. One more, apparently. Yeah, so, let's see. Should be at least one more, yeah, here. Oh, man. Oh, a doctor's bag. Oh, that's... Oh, man. I feel so rich right now. We got so much good shit. Saving again. I don't want to crash and lose that. I'll be so upset. So now we can get two more infections. And we'll be okay. There was one more in here. There should be a uh, survivor up top, too. And if we snipe him before he gets in his power armor, I guess we're done here. I guess there's nobody else here. If we snipe him before he gets in the power armor, um, we can... Uh, there's the whiskey. Have I gone insane again? I probably did. I need uh, Mentats to get my sanity back. I mean, I can use I can use Thorazine. It's just a huge waste to use right now. You know. I do have one purified water I could use too. I suppose. Go ahead and do that because we're already super low on hydration. Oh, that was the wrong button. Holy shit, I almost just killed myself. And it's all because I can't read because this fucking UI is really, really bad. Because the fall UI combined, like, don't get me wrong, I'm happy to have the UI I have, but the fall UI uh, in this version, like, I don't know, it, it looks bad. I almost killed myself there. Oh my god, I'm a moron. I thought I was drinking purified water. I thought the only thing that's in here is going to be purified water, right? And the uncooked yum yum eggs? No, it was it was the freaking. I thought about that earlier too. It was the uh, fungal purge. Thought about that earlier. I was like, yeah, I should probably just drop this because it's so it's gonna be so easy to like accidentally use this. I had, I didn't even I didn't even need to get rid of the rads. Oh man, let me drop some crap here before I kill myself from carrying too much crap, you know? Okay, we're no longer over encumbered. That's good. This thing's, uh, actually... I see things in the dark. That's great. 
I guess we're using... Well, but if I use Thorazine, I'm going to be even more thirsty. Blood pack for hydration? <laughs> Pretty sure that makes you sick. Ugh. I can't freaking believe I did that. I thought that was a mine for a second, but no, it's just a little doodad in the floor. I don't deserve to be alive. Everyone in, in the comments just went oof. Just went big oof. And, like, it's even worse is that, like, now I'm super low health and I don't really want to go upstairs. Okay, well, I have to look around anyway over here and loot stuff. There isn't a whole lot left to loot, though, to be honest. There's just a couple of those uh, medical things in here. There's not a ton, I guess. Less than I remembered. I thought there was a second one down here somewhere. Maybe it was removed, though. So there's two of those. Yeah, I'll use, use some Fury. That'll, that'll help out, I'm sure. The good thing is, it doesn't matter how insane I go. With a scoped rifle, I'll have still pinpoint accuracy as long as I'm either quick scoping or, you know, like, actually aiming down the sights. Shouldn't matter. Uh, can I get some water? It's like a water fountain in here anywhere. I would take some dirty water from the water fountain. That'd be fine. Or I could fill some bottles, that would probably work too, and then boil them down, that'd probably be fine. These sometimes have them in there too, but I don't see any in there, so... Ah, uh, there's a lot to explore in here. Why am I so freaking low on health now? Did my buff out go away? I'm ravenous. Am I losing health from the food? A bench going? No, I don't. Okay, hold on. Back. Bandage. I think I have to go and cook some food. Like, right meow. Or I'm just gonna die from uh, being too hungry. Fuck, and that over-encumbrance is going to kill me, too. I don't think infection can actually kill you. <laughs> get out, get out, get out, get out, get out of there! Come on, Nate, we're going to fuck up! <sighs> okay, that's better. I'm losing, I'm losing endurance because I need to eat. That's all we can make right now because I need probably some wood. Okay, look for some wood and we can eat some more food. Come on, get the fuck out. You do not want to take encumbrance damage right now. Oh my god, it's like this precarious balancing act. Okay, good. There's food around here. Noodle cup. Oh, noodle cup. Oh, noodle cup. Oh, thank you, noodle cup. That's a two-for-one deal right there. Canned dog food's gonna be a sandy hit. Don't really want to do that. Melon. Can you see the melon just, like, plain? Is it fine? I think we can... I don't even know what you do with, with melon. With the corn, I can cook it. I need some wood. There's some wood. There's some dirty water. I gotta find a... Uh... Come on, give me that pie. You know, it's glass. Just break it open, man. I'm just saying. Just break it open. Ooh, some cram. If I get a few more bottles, I could look outside for a puddle or something, but like if there's a- oh, uh, can I feel it from here? No, you could do that in like Fallout 3. 
could drink from the toilet if you wanted to. Should be more careful looking at these to make sure I'm not tripping any grenade bouquets or anything. Okay. Alright, well, I can relax a little bit. We're in a lot better shape than we were. Um, gotta find some more wood. We're, we're like no longer in immediate danger of dying at least that's that's the point we buy a steak corn in the cub oh I did, shouldn't have done that that has that has water in it too could have drank that water as a last resort if I needed to and get an infection immediately again I don't think that makes you thirsty. I'm going to go ahead, go ahead and use it. So getting like weakness would be like just wonderful if I got weakness right after that. Alright, so corn in the cob. Oh my god. We're actually properly fed now. Okay, so we just need drinks and we'll be okay. Which I've got plenty of drinks. i got plenty of uh, bottles. I can make more boiled water back at the base. Okay. Okay. We're okay. Calm down a little bit. Hope you're all enjoying yourselves because I'm stressed out as fuck. Alright, I'm gonna look around. Um, I want to be efficient, you know, and not be here too long, but I want to look around make sure I got everything that I want here. Springs from these things is pretty good. Circuitry from that thing's pretty good. We got some uh, strength back, so we're not so weak anymore. I think we have like negative strength before because of uh, moldy food. I'll take too because that's going to be useful for um, crafting antibiotics later on. I want to kill this turret. Just steal. Don't really need that. Don't need that stuff. Don't need that stuff. There is some lore here I want to get to. I want to um, kill this turret for the ammo. Now that my. These are all. Yeah, I'll use the IED. Didn't kill it. Surprising. It was just like so close to being dead. Yeah, I want this thing. Good loot there. I guess I'll have plenty of moldy food whenever I, I can actually make antibiotics. I'm pretty sure that's how you make them in uh, Frost, too. It's just the standard Fallout 4 base game recipe, right? That goes outside. Okay. So I think we go upstairs now. Anything in here? Nuka Cola. That's also pretty good. That's some sandy restoration, right? Nuka Cola. Yeah, I'll do it. It's gonna make me more hungry, but um, I'm okay on food now. I have that. I'm I'm one up on food. Oh, by the way, uh, I got like multiple levels here. Can I? Do lock picking rank up yet? Yes, I can. Excellent. Because I'm pretty sure there are more of those things in here. This is the uh, the burn room. Got it. Yeah. Yeah. Or maybe there aren't. I don't know. That gas canister is going to be too much. Flamer. Okay, there's a lot of flamer and flamer fuel in here, though. That's cool. Uh, do I have a flamer back at the base? This is not a very good one. I think I'll just take the ammo for it for now. And that thing was really heavy, too. Okay, that's good. Alright, that's fine. That is totally fine. 
Um, everything else. Got everything in here. It's a safe over here. Did I get the safe? There's a door over here too, yeah. Maybe there's more more stuff over beyond that door because I remember there being... Oh, it's, it's uh, Ben's beautiful thought of the day. Humans spend 33.3% of their lives asleep. They spend 50% of that dreaming. That means that 16.16% of your life experience has never happened. That was a lot of percentages there, Ben. All right. Yeah, maybe there's more over here because I really remember there being more than just like two medical things here, you know? Yes. Ah, yes. Okay, good. One more over here. Stim pack, purified water. Okay, no antibiotics, but you know, the purified water is really nice. More brain fungus. Brain fungus and Abraxo makes Mentats, which uh, helps a bunch of sanity. Right away. Yeah, there's good stuff in here. Definitely want to get this place, for sure. Microscope might be kind of nice. kind of premium junk there. Alright. Um, this is pretty bad. This one's not great either. We sort by uh, weight here. Yeah, connecting rod, goodbye. Metal bucket, goodbye. Don't need those. Gas canisters, not worth it for just one oil. This all take plastic copper and ends gears are all good. Yeah, that's good. Don't need that. Take that. Okay, and then we're at a surplus of 10 weight. That should be good. All right, feeling a lot better. Okay, I think we're done on this level. Let's go and get the lore and stuff over here. Gotta unlock it to actually loot this guy. Where's the, um... Where's the diary or the book or whatever? Was that moved? Might have been moved, actually. Now that I think about it. That's one of these guys had it. I don't think they did, though. Note. Serrated machete. That's an upgrade. That's a nice upgrade. Bye-bye, tire iron. Hello, serrated machete. That's a big upgrade. This thing has bleeding on it, too. This is, like, one of the better... Like, easily accessible uh, melee weapons. All right, what's the note say? Rolo, keep grilling him. If we can break into one of those military bases, we'll be set for life. More ammo than you can carry, more food than you can eat. And if we can fix one of those birds, what I'm saying is don't let them die. They're a goddamn information gold mine. Right, because there were two... Um, there were a bunch of survivors holed up here. Some of them were medical staff and stuff. Um, some of them were not. But, um, there were survivors hold up here. I wonder if this has any, any more new data on it. Let me check here real quick. Sweet. Nah, it's just safe control. Never mind. Okay. Thought maybe, perhaps, um, there'd be more info there about this place. But anyway, um... Sure, already have a syringer back at the base, so I don't really care that much about them. I mean, it's worth a bit. Eh, it's whatever. Anyway, uh, a vertebrate crashed into the roof, and they were interrogating the guys and the vertebrate about their their possible bases and stuff, locations, what whatnot. So this is um, two steel and two oil for three weight. It's pretty good, actually. I do need oil. I just... A lot of the stuff that you get oil in is just uh, very, very 
heavy and does not give you very much oil. You know, I gotta prioritize what I'm taking back, you know? Telephone's good junk, too. Come on. Give me the telephone. Okay, whatever. Keep the telephone. Right, so now I'm healed back up enough. Um, I should be able to go upstairs. Just checking very carefully flew around here. There's like the only skeleton, only baby skeleton in like uh, all of Fallout, by the way. There might be more, but that's the only one I've ever seen, I think. Gotta drop something here. Um, I don't know what to drop. Well, I have a bunch of bones and stuff I can get rid of. I don't think bones are really useful for anything. I don't think I meant to pick those up. Okay. So yeah, there's a guy that's going to be in power armor up here. And uh, we're going to kill him. And hopefully if we kill him fast enough... Oh, that's right. There's a door over here. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's, it's upstairs. Yeah, another, another area. There might be more survivors up here, actually. Okay, maybe not. I guess I killed them all. They must have come downstairs. But, um... This just goes back down. It's a shortcut to go back downstairs. If we snipe the guy and, and headshot him quick enough, um, he won't get in his power armor, and I think it'll have a fusion core in it. Now, if we don't kill him fast enough, he probably... I don't think he'll have a fusion core on him. I think it's it's weird how it works. Get him before he goes in the power armor. It should have a fusion core. If not, then it won't. Let's see again, just in case. Do we still have a bandage going? No, we don't. Yeah, really good haul, guys. This this is a uh, a limb fixing thing. Um, we probably won't need it to be honest, but still nice to have. There's no reason I shouldn't be able to just, like, headshot this guy and kill him real quick. There's, like, two survivors here. We gotta kill them both fast. And there's the power armor. I'll probably just swap my leg out for that one. I fucked up. Great. Oof. Oof. Okay. See ya. Fuck that. That was like half my health in one shot. Yeah, I messed that one up, guys. That one was my bad. 100% my bad. Um, I can go out this way, but... Like, there are gonna be guys out there right away. And I need to heal up and stuff, and I don't want to use, like, more stim packs if I don't have to. So... I think we're gonna call this expedition good and head back up. Like, I'm, I'm happy with what we've done, but uh, I don't want to risk more right now. Let's go back up, repair the power armor. See if we can make any upgrades, like explosive shielding and stuff. I want to try that too, because I've been informed that there is a power armor workbench in downtown that I'm just a moron I didn't see. Like, it was literally right in front of me, I didn't see it, because I'm just stupid. Or maybe I saw it and didn't... Like, it just didn't register that, oh, I should repair my power armor there. I don't know. Sometimes I'm a dumb dumb, guys. There should be um, stuff around the back here, too. And there should be Slim, too. Slim's right around the corner here. Did I kill two turrets? No, just the one. That's from the other one that I killed earlier. And we got a Radstorm Bruin. 
And it's getting late at night, too. Slim should be just around the corner over here. I think this is, in fact, uh, Slim's courtyard uh, marker over here. I think. He's right next to Mass Bay Medical. That's what it's called, Mass Bay Medical. I kept thinking, like, Milton General, or there's like a bunch of M-named uh, hospitals. Right, around the back here there's some stuff. There's usually a survivor back here. But I think I drew him out and killed him already. Oh yeah, here we go. Blood packs. You can use those to. I think you use those with the glowing blood pack or glowing uh, whatever to make uh, glowing blood packs later on. Glowing blood to make glowing blood. Pa glowing blood packs. God, I can't talk. And that's too much weight. Let's drop some more crappy junk here. All these are pretty good things I want to keep. I think. Don't care about that too much. I think this 10 mil's gotta go. It's not that great of like ratio, you know? Biometric scanner is pretty good, good pretty good loot. Vodka bottle, we need bottles pretty bad. Army fatigues, I'll take that for sure. See, I'll go back up there and kill that guy eventually. But he's got a nice plasma rifle. Like, you guys saw it took half my health. It's pretty dangerous. What can I drop here? Just like a new Shanka hat, maybe? That does it just barely. Okay, and then like we're really, really full. We gotta go back now. Let's go back inside. It does. There's like three doors you can get in through this place. All right, so we're gonna go back the way we came. Just to be like ultra safe. I was a bit off on my, where I thought this was, but I mean close enough, I guess. Antiseptic. Shit, it's too much. I gotta drop something, because that's worth it. Antiseptic's always worth it. Am I hungry? Yeah, I'm hungry. I can, I can eat this corn on the cob. Is that enough? Nope. Um... Water, I guess. Okay, that'll do it, just barely. That's a horde. Waste the ammo, I'll just kill him with melee. have insomnia. Well, whatever. Insomnia is better than what I had before. Alright, let's, uh, let's mark where we're going there. Shit, I need that too. The eternal struggle. I right, just gotta drop a heavy thing here. Microscope's too good to drop, though. I'll drop a, a phone. 
I probably won't need that much trick or tree. Hey, it's a level up. And cow meat. Okay, we got a bunch of food here. Gotta drop more stuff. Uh, buy phones. I guess we're dropping all of you. Or maybe the oil canister. Nah, I'll do the dust fan. Nah. Yeah, telephones. Sorry, phones. You gotta go. I need the food. We're like over on the coast now. I don't really actually want to be over there. Okay. There is the uh, the hotel over there, the Harbor Master Hotel, which is pretty good loot. But I I can't I can't carry anything more right now. This is a oh, the Hub Three Sixty is not that bad actually. It's not where I thought it was. Scoping in, I can probably carry back for some caps. Right, right, right. I, I was through here already. So I know I'm okay going through here. This has been cleared. Joe's Spuckies. That's a place I'm thinking of. Joe's Spuckies. Guys, there's a bunch of very, very dangerous enemies in here. You do not want to go in here. I mean, you do. You want the loot, right? But, uh... There's gonna be a guy with a missile launcher, most likely. An army remnant with a missile launcher. Um, it's, it's potentially a very bad time. Well, not, not a crazy medical box, but uh, still pretty good. Some good chems there. And a bunch of bottles, which I need, unfortunately, so... Dropping more shit. stuff. Okay, bye. It is kind of silly that you have to keep getting more bottles that you only get like one in every three back. This, uh... Von Hall? No, hey, no, I forget. Yeah, this is Von Hall. Okay. We do not want to go in here right now. Because we can't carry shit. We want to go this way. Around the back. I heard footsteps over there. Hello. I thought I heard myself walk over something. Didn't know those were there. Okay, and just around the corner... And we're home. Oh, guys. Guys and gals and ghouls. This was a stressful episode. I'm not going to lie. The most stressful I've done so far because I have a lot to lose. You know? I'm going to unpack everything. Except for the armor fatigues. I'll keep those. Gas mask is nice. Going to unpack most of this stuff too. Don't need most of it.
the Thorazine I will try to save. Um, I'm gonna buy out a bunch of, uh... I'm gonna buy out a bunch of booze and stuff if I can. I'll check Opal, Opal for booze too. Got a lot of ammo, actually. I can sell a lot of this ammo, like, we don't need all of it. Um... I don't have a whole lot of uh, long range stuff though, you know? I have to look through this stuff and decide what I want to use at some point. Uh, laser rifle is really nice. Plasma rifle is good too. Need to be scoped though, you know? Fusion core is getting low too. Okay, there we go. We are equipped pretty well now, so we don't have a mining helmet or anything, which would be nice. But whatever. Oh yeah, I should take my power armor over and try to repair it, shouldn't I? And uh, look at what upgrades I can do. I should definitely do that over in the downtown area where I'm gonna uh, take less um, hunger and hydration loss because you use energy slower there over there. Man, I made some bad mistakes this time, didn't I? So far, so good. But I guess you know it all worked out, right? So yeah, right over here there should be a uh, power armor station thing. Be careful out there. Oh, it is right. Okay, yeah, it's, it's tucked in over here. That's where it is. All right, cool. I will take that fusion core just to make sure nobody steals this thing. Okay, so the leg's almost broken. Um. You lack the requirements to repair this item. Um, okay, so what is required to repair? It doesn't say, unfortunately. I'm gonna assume it's like blacksmithing or something. I might have to ask. This is melee weapon mods. Armor? Probably gonna be armor, so I'm gonna have to invest some points into strength anyway for armor. So... Rank 1 you can repair Raider. Rank 2 you can repair T45. Okay, well, let me check, but I think I have some spare pieces here. I can just use those instead. So it's, um, right, it's the right leg. The right and left legs are both pretty low. Everything else is pretty reasonable, so right and left legs. I think, I unfortunately, don't have any spares, though, for those. Because these are already busted, yeah. So, how to just find some more power armor, I guess. There is, or there should be, some power armor down by the uh, South Boston checkpoint down here. Um, there's that power armor on the guy that's in the uh, Mass Medical Center too, which I can try to kill. He's going to be very, very dangerous though, because he's got that plasma rifle and it hurts really bad. So that's, that's rough. We did surprisingly get quite a bit of uh, food though. Venison is good stuff, too, for the carry weight. It's really good. Oh, I should have done this instead. The small ribeye steak. Oh, well. Scavers stew. Boiled water. Canned dog food. Okay. Oh, it uses uh, brain fungus, though. So 
actually you can make some pretty good stuff if you save up your cram with the um, Survivor's MRE. Requires cram, mutt chops, and roasted crab meat, which I'll have in abundance later on, and then uh, brain fungus. But the brain fungus is a tough part. Like, that's kind of... You're trading Sandy for that. I don't know. I'm just going to make my cram for now. That'll be good. Okay, so then we got to make um, homemade water filter. How do you make those? Gotta find it out. That'd be nice. Yeah, I'm not gonna use up my uh, my brain fungus for that. Okay, so we gotta go. Be careful out there. We gotta go and make some more water too. So it's only inside of here that you consume less energy. Not not in the uh, power armor area, unfortunately. Which is fine. It's not a big deal. All right, so let me get out all of my. Um, my bottles. Is that all of them? That does look to be it. Okay. Fill those up. So far, so good. Cook them down. Okay, let's get um, let's get ourselves. I'm gonna use some alcohol too. Since those restore sandy, I'm gonna use some of them too. Okay, that's fine. We're properly hydrated. Um, properly fed. Okay, I mean, we're, we're all right. Our sandy is very, very low, though. Yeah, we're 24. So if we don't have alcohol, we pretty much go insane right away. Which is not great. All right, so I might go through some of this off screen and do some selling and stuff because it's going to get pretty tedious if I keep all of that 100% of it in. Um... And then maybe look at buying some booze and stuff. I don't know. Maybe I'll just do it next episode. But yeah, that's going to be it for uh, this episode, guys. was a pretty tense one, but we got through it just barely, just by the skin of our teeth. Even with me being a moron and using some fungal purging accent and almost killing myself. It does kill you, by the way, if you drink it when you're too low of health. So, anyway, we got through it. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.